And we're back with Smackdown Live Recap. Number with two. Ashley. Melissa. Justin. And lots of stuff going on now. So, um, let's see. Of course, in the beginning, we have a silence for the 9-11. So, yeah, and then I went right to getting ready for a match, Jeff Hardy and... Nakamura, but first, Jeff Hardy had a couple of words saying how he, he's got Randy Orton to fight at Helm's Sale. If anything, what do I say about that match? Randy's gonna win it. I mean, I don't, I don't Randy's know. Randy's the most I'm popular. Sorry. Randy's winning. I mean, the Viper's probably gonna win. Because. I like Randy really much. Really much. So, I'm probably going to vote for Randy. I like both of them, but I'm pretty sure... I've always liked um, Randy Orton. So, I'm positive he's going to be the one to win. I've always liked him. So, that's that. And then, of course, Jeff Hardy was close on winning and by a DQ. Yeah, he was in a match with uh, Shinsuke Nakamura. Yeah. yeah, I didn't see his maneuver. See, his maneuver. It always yeah. makes me laugh. Every yeah, that always makes me laugh every time he does it. <laughs> yeah, Shinsuke. so. So, yeah. And, and then. Of course, Randy came out, hit him in a chair, but. And then. He, he twisted. He t he twisted fate. He grabbed, had a hold of the chair and he hit him in the chair instead. But Yep, and twisted fate to Orton and swap. Swan Tom bomb to Orton, and that's how it ended. That one. So, um, then it showed like a little segment with Styles before SmackDown even started. Like, showed a clip of him talking, saying how he's gonna beat Samoa Joe because that's Samoa Joe talks about his family and stuff, and that and puts his family into yeah. everything. And whatnot. then Samoa Joe ended up doing a promo, Dr. Seuss style. With the rhyming, with a little book. Yeah, that was a little later on during the show. Samoa Joe did a little story called Night Night mm. AJ. <laughs> that, was, that was actually pretty interesting. Kind of scary. Kind of scary. It's like more like yeah. a nightmare for a... Uh, yeah, it's kind of like the story I wanna of the time on uh, WWE. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> it's kind of like that. It's like I want to see Samoa Joe reading The Grinch on Christmas. Let's hear him read the whole the whole book. Am I? Who knows what'll happen? Would you Would you want to see Samoa Joe do that? Thumbs up if you do. Or um, comment. Or comment. Comment. Tell me what you think. Okay. Um, Charlotte defeated Sony Deville, of course. And her match. Um, and then all of a sudden, Charlotte was clapping hands after her match. And then being the fans. Being, being with the fans, getting a picture of one. And, and then out of the blue, Becky the, Lynch grabbed her hair. and Yeah, grabbed her hair because she was disguised as a fan with a wig and all that. And glasses. And, and backed her and saying she's going to be the championship this Sunday at Hell in a Cell. I mean, I kind of want to see her, Jimmy. I mean... She deserves that second chance. Because when she was the champion, it was like two years ago, she, Charlotte's had the belt more. I mean, yeah, Charlotte's good and all, but... They want to have her... Uh, uh, Becky. Her type, they want Charlotte to have the same amount of title shots Becky. as her dad. Got your back, Becky. Um, I got the bar verse. Rusev Day. Yay. I mean, I'm happy because Rusev Day won, so he they're going against New Day at Helm Cell. Yeah, for that someone takes out the tartar sauce. Yeah, she don't like yeah. Sheamus. I hate Sheamus and Cesaro. I don't like either one of them. <laughs> yeah, you do. You like Cesaro and Sheamus. I like Rusev Day. <gasps> Rusev <Yay>. Day. <laughs> um, but. Yeah, I'm happy. I hope Bruce today actually beats New Day. I hope there's a chance. So, yeah. And then you got R-Truth and Cian Olmez 
Of course, Sian Olmez won by cheating because he pulled his shorts. I mean, Carmella tried to... Well, no, Carmella actually... Yeah. Carmella, Carmella tried to interfere and help out our truth Because the Vega girl was helping out. So, then Sian pulled up with the shorts. Like always, because they're bad guys. We gotta be. But... I kind of like this R Truth and Carmella that the mix tag team. It's kind of interesting, like how they come out and with the what's up. They're kind of yeah. interesting together. I, I'm excited to watch this mix tag team challenge this time. I mean, really, little big again, Ugh, and Oscar and the Miz again. Well, at least it's not at James Ellsworth, at Ellsworth again. I mean, but what happened to the big cast? I have no idea. I haven't heard. If you know anything about the cast, comment down, comment down below. Because I have I don't even remember. So. I probably do. I just forgot. Did you get fired or something? I have no idea. So. And then, of course, the main event. Brie Bella versus Maurice. And it ends up being a DQ. Because Miz interfered and grabbed Brie. Yep. And then, of course, they were having a brawl back and forth with the... Punching the... Uh, yes, you know, like first, yes. First it was Brie... First it was Brie and Daniel, then it ended up being Ms. and Maurice. Then it ended up being Brie and Daniel standing out tall because Daniel's like, Do not put your hands on my wife. Yep. And then at the end, was just, Yes! Yes! And yes. I believe she punched the Miz. Yeah, she did. Because he tried, he blocked the punch from Daniel, turned around and got knocked by Bree. Yep, and then Daniel Bryan took him out. Yeah. Well, the rain just, yes, 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 yes. yes. Is that another Hell in a Cell match? Yeah, it's a mixed tag team. In the Hell in a Cell? I don't know if it's that. I don't think so. I think it's just a regular match. No, because if you put that in a Hell in a Cell, where's Miz going to go? Where's he going to weasel out this time? I mean, he ain't going to get no brass knuckles or anything like that. Mm -mm. Mm -hmm. I don't even think there's going to be brass knuckles on. Unless, unless Maurice hides it and takes it out during the match. Yeah, I wonder where she would hide it this time. Yep, you never know. But then again, in a Hell in a Cell match, there's no disqualifications. Um, she could slip it through the bars. Yeah. And that's or, pretty much it. Yeah, it's SmackDown was really short. Not SmackDown that much. was always short. I Whatever mean, happened to the the cruiserweight matches and all that stuff? They would usually but, throw one in. No, cruiserweight was only in Raw. You sure? Yeah, I'm pretty sure. But if I had to rate SmackDown. Between a one and a, t one and a five? No, one and a ten. It's one and a five. I will give SmackDown... A four. I mean, probably a six. Just like I gave Raw. It's even. But then again, Ashley... I would give it a seven. But then again, seven. Raw... But then Same Ashley... Same as that. They like did with the other... I mean, they could do a little better, I really But then, yeah. remember, it's you. It's not I mean, fair to give them between a 1 and a 10, because Raw, you rating it on Raw, it's because Raw has 3 hours. SmackDown has only, what, 2? So, just do that by half. It's just about fair. So, I'm 1 to 5, then. I will give it a 4. Then, alright, well... I'll give it a five. What do you give it, Justin? Three and a half. Three and a half? Okay, three and a half, four and five. Just like Raw was five, six, and seven. <laughs> <laughs> but, yeah, so comment down below what you thought about SmackDown. And what your feelings were. Were you? Like, like what did you Did you like SmackDown? Did you care about it? Did you enjoy story time? Yes. Did you get, did you really enjoy? Did you get sleepy here into Small Joe? Yeah. I mean, it's he's got all it's, that flubber to look at. Yeah. But... Do, does he make you sleep? Like he wants you to sleep? I want Small Joe over here to put the, her to sleep. Oh. <laughs> no, thank you. Comment down below if you want uh, if you want 
Samoa Joe uh, girl over here to be in the next SmackDown recap. <laughs> wow. Um, um, yeah. So, make sure you like, comment, subscribe for more SmackDown Live recap.